Welcome back to the channel and we're back with our daily PGV update and guess what the refunds are not completed so before we get any further remember the normal disclaimer here that nothing in this video is financial advice please always do your own research and only invest what you are willing to lose so we'll start off a quick look at the contract it's not changed in terms of the balance changing I had someone comment saying that it was used, I think, for the gem bots. So that was why the balance went slightly down and the gem bots went slightly up. In terms of functions on the contract, they're still paused. You cannot deposit, you cannot claim, you cannot self-refund. The one positive, though, with all of this is that we're still earning gems every single day worth well, dollars. So it's 1.25% per day, meaning I'm earning $62.50 per day. We can see now my claimable. Currently, if they turn it back on, it's $438. Claims won't actually be turned back on for four days. And that's if they actually stick to the deadline. So who knows at that point. But if it lasts another four days, that's an extra $250, which would take this total up to around $700. Which, if I can eventually claim that, that would take my harvested gems to around 3,500 gems which would mean my risk capital would only be about $1,500, which would be very nice at that point. But I'll jump into the Discord and take a look. So, if we go to the normal announcements channel. First off, yesterday, we saw there was a scam email. This literally came through live while I was recording the video. And Manny, or creator, has said, yes, this is a scam. Be careful, this is not us. We have emailed no one. Quick update, tech guys got back to me. They would let uh, me know. It'll be another three hours looking forward to getting this done. And then there's another post from Manny. If you got an email, it's a scam, basically. And there's a fake site called Prosperity Ven Gem Ventures Ultimate. And someone's just copied the site and it's all a scam. So do not interact with any other different contracts, emails. Don't do anything. It's a scam. PGV doesn't have a, dis uh, a Telegram as well, so any Telegram groups are a scam. Just whatever is in the official Discord is real. Then, there is this one I found quite funny. They created a new quarantine channel in the Discord. If you can see it, you can visit it and ask why you have been quarantined. If you can't see the channel, everything is good. So I guess if you're fudding or spamming the Discord or doing something that mods or slash admins don't like you'll be put in the quarantine channel which i thought was quite funny but then we had a hefty video from manny a nice little 23 minute banger today well last night and i'll break it down very simply so originally of course if you watch the t previous videos manny said his tech team was going to set up an amazing contract which would do all of the refunds per contract in free transactions. So that would have meant he could do the BSC USDT refunds, free transactions. Polygon, free transactions. Tron, free transactions. It would take nine transactions to do all of the refunds and they would all magically be completed in one hour. And of course, the tech team couldn't get it working or they didn't make it, etc which means the refunds didn't get done yesterday. And I know people are already kind of expecting these deadlines now to not be met, etc. This one annoyed me a little bit more because I was manually deleted his announcements. I, again, that's another thing that annoys me. When he sets um, deadlines and says things, when they're not here, he deletes the posts. Again, you can see in yesterday's video, there was a post around here literally just above this message two announcements from manny saying there's no doubt in my mind they will be done this day etc and of course they're not which again i'm not hating i'm not fudding i think at this point it's just a bit frustrating because it's been date set oh it's delayed date set this is it no delayed today's the final day now it's delayed again but this one I think will actually be somewhat close slash real. So, um, of course, the tech team couldn't make this super contract to send all the refunds. So what does that mean? That means Manny is going back 
to the batch refund contracts, which we have been looking at over the past few videos, is linked in the dis uh, description down below, the batch refund for BSC. And basically, these are the contracts where it allows Manny to send multiple refunds at once. He just has to manually enter the wallet address and the amount, which is better than back when he first started doing refunds when it was just one at a time. He can do batches, it's just manual batches. And basically what he has said in this 20 minute video is that he well he tried to get the tech team to fix this whole situation and make an easy contract. Meanwhile though, he basically said he's taken a break and he wouldn't have actually done refunds during that period. He was just hoping the tech team maybe could do a solution while he was taking a break. So this time frame where we haven't seen any refunds, which is around seven days now. Well, I guess he started back on Polygon nine hours ago. But around eight days, seven days, Manny basically took a week off, which again, I've got nothing against, but just kind of be honest with us and say, like, I'm taking a break. Don't set some unrealistic deadlines, but again, I'm not fudding, etc. It's just a bit more frustration. So now he has these three contracts and there's about 1,100 wallets left to refund. So he claims. So if we take a look at this post here, well, this was pertaining to the video. Just to be clear again, as stated in the video, 250 refunds a day, no more and no less. So he set a, basically a four day deadline. There's about a thousand refunds. He's gonna do 250 per day, no more, no less. And the refunds will be finished in four days, March 21st. After March 21st, then the refunds will be finished They'll turn back on the USDC contract, sort this stuff out. And then I guess after that, they'll actually look at people who've paid this pre-sale for the Gembot subscription who haven't heard anything in about five days. But yeah, 250 refunds a day using these free batch refund contracts. So Manny did link them in the Discord, which is nice to see. Again, I think the BSC one's linked in the description of this video. So we can go ahead and track here and see the refunds. I'll be counting tomorrow to see if there's been 250 and um, let's hope this whole situation is over with. We can see he did what well, he pumped fund and then did two refund transactions on Polygon earlier. This was for four refunds and then this one here was for one refund. I don't know why they didn't pump the funds a bit more. Maybe he was just testing it out, etc. I'm not too sure on that front, but 250 per day. We've got the free contracts. It's going to take four days and should be finished by the 21st. But again, who knows? There's probably going to be more delays, etc. But we'll see. I guess we'll give it a day and see if 250 get done. If they do get done, then we're looking good. If they don't get done, then we're looking at more delays probably. But yeah, thank you guys for watching. I hope you have enjoyed this one. And I'll see you tomorrow for another update.